Hi everyone, it's Rob here at ASFC Chemistry and what we're going to do is show you what happens or what could potentially happen if a child was to swallow one of these small lithium, little flat round, 3 volt batteries. And we're going to replicate this by putting one of these batteries in between a few sheets of ham and add a little bit of deionized water to represent the saliva. And we're going to show you a time lapse and then a little analysis of the kind of damage it does to the meat. So this would replicate the inside of a child's throat. This is important because it's part of a government campaign and a bit of a UK campaign and I suppose a global response to the fact that loads of kids are choking on these batteries every year. And this video was specifically recorded around Christmas time when obviously purchasing batteries and electronics is a little bit more common than normal. So I just want you to be mindful and don't worry obviously this was all just done using a piece of ham so you don't have to worry about anyone being harmed uh, making this video. So for this bit, we can see as well, if you look on the underside, so this would be inside of the kid's throat. But even worse, if the kid managed to swallow this, then we're one hour, 50 minutes in, so we're just under that technically with the clock, so 148 for this. But that would be inside their stomach potentially now. And obviously there's already acid in there, so you can think of the kinds of damage. This is gonna require surgery to fix, but you can see, look at the darkened circle for this bit. You can see now that this pulls away quite easily from there now. It is really damaged tissue, so this would require some sort of surgery. And the battery itself is actually starting to affect the other side, but it's definitely this side with the lip on it, which causes the most damage. All right? So if you actually look on BBC, they've done something very similar for this, and there's like a big campaign around Christmas to stop kids choking on these, because that's two hours, literally just two hours. So a kid swallows one of these, chokes maybe a little bit, but then gets it all the way down. They might not tell you that they feel ill, for five or six hours. Imagine the kind of damage that could take place after six hours of that. That's really quite bad. So just be mindful and have a look for the campaign. If I can find any more videos on it, then I'll put them on the channel for it as well. But if you've got any small kids in your families and things like that, just be mindful or just like pass on a little helpful reminder. 